Happening today, another shot at history for SpaceX as the company is set to try again to launch the most powerful rocket ever built. It comes after Monday's Starship launch attempt from Texas was turned into a dress rehearsal after a technical problem. Mark Lehman is monitoring the countdown. He joins us live in studio. And Mark, Elon Musk says things are looking good so far. He sent out a message overnight saying all systems are currently green for launch. Teams right now are working towards a hopeful first test flight of a fully assembled Starship and super heavy rocket. After years of testing Starship at SpaceX's Texas launch site, we could be just hours away from a first liftoff of the spacecraft as it's strapped to a staggering 33 engines, making it the world's most powerful rocket. Everything's looking good, uh, except for the one pressurization issue that the team is going to have to troubleshoot. On Monday, teams were less than 20 minutes from launch when a stuck pressure valve forced a scrub. Decision right now is that we are going to stop the launch for today. We're going to transition the launch attempt to a wet dress rehearsal. A run through continuing because of everything that's at stake. Starship is designed to take astronauts to the moon and eventually to Mars. If the launch happens this morning, the heavy booster should separate three minutes after liftoff with the spacecraft splashing down near Hawaii in a best case scenario. Leaders with NASA will be watching closely. NASA selected SpaceX as the taxi for its Artemis 3 moon mission to ferry astronauts from the SLS rocket down to the surface of the moon and back. Earlier this week, Elon Musk said expectations for this test flight shouldn't be too high, and he's just hoping the rocket clears the tower. Now, the launch window opens at 9.30 this morning. If it happens, we'll carry it live on News 6 at 9. Crystal?